Hi folks, this is Andrew from awardconsulting.net and today I'm going to walk you through an IPR I built using Twilio Studio. Studio is a new product from Twilio that gives you a visual builder to create a flow and to host a simple computer program um, on their servers that you can build using a drag and drop interface without actually writing code. And I've used this to build a, a fairly advanced uh, IVR and I'm going to walk you through what that looks like. So here's the scenario. This is actually a real life application for my wife's music school and we want to deal with people calling into the main number. And what we're going to do is actually pretty simple. We're going to partition the users into regular calls that need to go to our administrator and a particular scenario where somebody's calling about a lesson that they're supposed to have today where they're either going to miss the lesson or they're going to be late. And this latter scenario is interesting because in our school, the teachers will be busy teaching and we can't call them to notify them about the absence. Instead, what we need to do is we need to send them a text message to notify them of what's happening. And so somebody's going to be calling in and we want to identify what the problem is and who their teacher is so that we can notify the teacher by text message. And I built an IVR to do that. So let's walk through it. I should say to start that this is a simplification. There's no error checking in this one, but it's much easier to understand what's going on if we keep, keep it simple. So we start at the top with this trigger widget, and the trigger here is an incoming call, and I've tied this to our phone number uh, through the Twilio phone interface. So we have an incoming call, and the first thing that happens is we gather input. So we say an announcement, we say thank you for calling, if you're calling about a lesson today, then say today. For other inquiries, say other. And let's actually look at the other case first because that's pretty simple and less interesting. So let's get it out of the way. So um, whatever the user says, we go into this split speech result widget. And if they said other, then the system will recognize the word and it will send them over to this announcement here, say connecting, where we'll tell them that we're connecting their call. And then once that's done, we will connect the call to Janae, our administrator. It just calls her cell phone. Pretty straightforward. If, however, they say the word today, then we get into the interesting part of the IVR. So the first thing we do is we ask another question. We ask, are you running late or are you going to miss the lesson? OK, and we store that information. Um, actually, I've I did have a more advanced version here where we did different things depending what they said. Um, so we actually evaluate, did they say late or miss, so that we know they gave a valid response. And we store that information and then we ask another question. What is the student name? This time we don't really care what the response is, we're just going to store it so that we can pass that information on later. So we move on to another widget, identify teacher, and we ask another question, what is the name of the teacher? Then we move into the split teacher widget, and this time we do care very much what they said because we need to know which teacher to contact. So we compare the words they said to the list of valid teachers, and depending who they said, we then go into the appropriate widget. So for example, this text Ross widget. And if they said the name of the teacher was Ross, then we'll send a text message to Ross, and we obviously have his number, so we send it to his specific number. And the message includes the name of the student, includes whether they're going to be late or absent. And we can send it to the right person. And then we finish off assuming the message is sent successfully. We follow this sent arrow down to the bottom and play one final announcement to the caller saying that we have sent a text message to your teacher. And so just like that, we have a fairly you know, unusual, um, fairly advanced IVR that we've built for a specific application without writing any code. And this is all hosted on Twilio's platform which is pretty cool and I'm pretty sure that you can imagine how businesses would value having this level of customization, this level of flexibility available in their IVRs. So if that's you, if you're thinking it would be great to, uh, to be able to do this for some of my businesses, then feel free to reach out to us and um, I'd love to talk to you more about what can be done through this platform. Thank you very much.